Powered by Ford. Go further. I'm Aaron Baker from Techno Buffalo, and I don't know if you can hear it through the microphone, but there's some exciting music going on in the background. CES 2013 is not a dance party, though. We have to do some real work, and to that end, I've got an unboxing for you, friends. The HTC Butterfly is in the house or in the convention center. We're gonna take a look at it in a full unboxing Techno Buffalo style. Let's do this. So you wanted that HTC Droid DNA, but you didn't want the one on Verizon, or maybe you didn't like the red colors of the Droid DNA. Here is actually the original device, the HTC Butterfly. Now, they were calling it the J Butterfly for a while. Now on the box, it just says Butterfly. Not quite sure which branding they're going with, but at least on the box. Let's take a look at this sucker and open it up. And there is the Butterfly, kind of like the J Butterfly name, because I'm like, it just sounds just sounds kind of cool and creepy. So while I'm at that, special thanks to our partners at Negri Electronics. They were special and awesome, and they helped us get this device early. They're getting it next week, so be sure to check out NegriElectronics.com. They're on Twitter as well, at Negri Electronics. So be sure to check them out. And let's take a look at some of the specifications. You've got a 1.5 gigahertz quad-core Snapdragon S4 Pro CPU, a 5-inch 1080p HD display, so a full HD display. And when the Droid DNA came out, and actually when this came out as well, it was one of the first with a 1080p HD display, but we've seen so many, which we're live on location at CES right now, so many devices that have 1080p HD displays. So that's definitely kind of the buzz feature, if you will, of 2013. So five inches there, you've got an eight megapixel rear facing camera with 1080p HD video recording. HTC Sense 4 Plus running atop Android 4.1, also known as Jelly Beans. It's a really a nice device all around. Pull this out here. Bam, there we go. Wide angle front camera, 1080p, S4, Beats Audio all great features all around. Beautiful device, as you can see, a little bit more glossy than the uh, the Droid DNA on the back. Got kind of a pearly white with some, uh, I wanna say bedazzled, but that's probably not the best word, bejeweled background here. Beats Audio logo on the front. You've got HTC front-facing camera, you got back, you got home, you got recent applications. And then up top, you've got your 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, your power button, and then your micro SIM card slot as well. And then down here, your micro USB charging port. Volume rocker on the right side and then your eight megapixel camera. Now again, it looks like you have a, a notification light as well. While that's powering on, let's see what comes in the box. Put that down. Instructions I can't read. End user license agreement I can read. Micro SIM card removal tool, You've got IMEI stuff. And you got your AC adapter module over here. And HTC's cornstarch bags. You've got some earbuds. You've got a micro USB charging cord as well. Let's just take a look. You know what this looks like. It's nothing new here by any means. We got micro like USB, and all kinds of accessory goodness. That is also not anything that I can read, but we're gonna do our best here. We're gonna open it up and see if we can switch around the language, which good, English, United States, let's do that. So you can see here, Sense 4 Plus running, like I said, top Android 4.1. Got the similar stuff you're familiar with on Sense 4.1. Seven home screens on this device at a maximum. And then you've got down here, applications out of the box. You've got Dr. I, KK Box, PDF Viewer, and then of course all the typical stuff you would expect. Five inch display device, really awesome. Coming soon to Negri Electronics if you wanna get this device in the States. Keep it locked on Techno Buffalo for continuing coverage of the HTC Butterfly or J Butterfly, whatever the heck they're calling it these days. Be sure to stay tuned. Like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Techno Buffalo. Hit me up on Twitter and let me know what you think of this device. I'm at Aaron C. Baker, the company's at Techno Buffalo, and we'll be sure to cover it much more in the days and weeks ahead. Keep it locked on the site for continuing coverage, and as always, we'll see you next time. iHeart Auto is the best way to access hundreds of radio stations all across the country. We can stream our favorite San Francisco radio stations when out here in Vegas or on the go anywhere. Sync App Link allows us to wirelessly play those tunes straight through our car stereo and control the app using only voice commands. Switch stations, like and skip songs, and navigate safe stations all without lifting a finger. Sync App Link is just another example of how Ford is committed to going further and keeping you connected while on the go. Thanks again to Ford for powering this Techno Buffalo CES special.